nominated Jo for this award because um, I wanted her to be acknowledged for what she does and for her to feel proud of herself because I don't think she always stops and, and realises actually she's making a huge different, uh, difference to Norfolk Libraries um, and she's just a very inspiring figure. Well, I've worked for the council now since 2001, um, just before this library opened. I think Jo is motivated by her kindness and compassion for her colleagues and, and for the public. Everything she does is about um, inclusivity and making sure the people of Norfolk are represented um, in what we do as a library service. Well, I feel that um, public buildings need to be places that people feel included, so it's, it's really important to show that quite visually. So I've done story to LGBTQ story times, and we have an archive here that I help with as well. So I think it's important for the community now and people to feel it's a safe place that they can come to, particularly as it is a public building. Jo makes a huge difference in her day-to-day -day job. Um, her personality is really inspiring and she lifts us all up and brings her along with her whatever she's working on. So with her work with the LGBT History Collection and with the club, um, her work with Terence Higgins Trust or um, to make even the staff lose gender neutral, uh, she makes a big difference to everybody that works here and uses the library. The thing I love most about the job that I do the people, like libraries are the best place to work ever pubs might be okay but you know I think but libraries are probably best places to work ever because you're meeting people you're not trying to sell them anything um, you're, you're sharing um, experiences you're a public place one of the only public places where people can come and just be themselves and um, I, I just love being with people and, and share and sharing um, you know the, the amazing building that we have here all the all the materials that we have um, and you know all the LGBTQ stuff that we're doing. People are so um, happy that we're, we're able to offer. It feels like something extra. It shouldn't be something extra. It should be something that's really included. So we're really trying to embed the LGBTQ stuff into our into our library service and the county council as a whole. I got a bit choked up there. <laughs> God's sake! Oh, not passionate. <laughs> Oh dear. <laughs>